here come our entries for our first seed of the evening. Here's the number one subtle pair. There's Rock Eyed Optimus owned and being driven this evening by Mr. Maurice Rayner. And with the number two saddle pad, Double Time. Double Time owned by the Martin Stanley and being driven this evening by Miss Candace Martins. Again, those of you following on the race program, special goal has been scratched from this race. Our stock car has collected our first two entries of the evening. Our first heat, two ponies up and out. Out of the first turn they come, it is Rock Eyed Optimus, the rail pony getting a jump on double time, who chases from behind, right in his kitchen though, as they go across us here for the first time on Spectator's turn. Candace Martins with double time. Pushing the issue as they head around Paddock Turn and down the backstretch. Rock Eyed Optimus out in front, setting the pace up over double time, double time. With Candace Martins and the bike going around the hang em high turn. Money Maurice Morena out of the Simfield turn. They have Rock Eyed Optimus still out in front. Still under pressure from double time as they go across up there one more time on Spectator's turn. Into Paddock Turn. And down the back stretch. It's Rock Eyed Optimus now giving itself a bit of breathing room. Open up a quarter length lead over double time as they head into the Hang High turn. Double time closing the distance again as they come out of the fourth turn. But uh, I think he left it a little bit too late. Not enough real estate. It's Rock Eyed Optimus over double time. Our entry for heat number two of the evening. With the number one saddle pad, some go somewhere. Owned by the Martins family, being driven this evening by Mr. Tashi Zul. With the number two saddle pad, Reign of Terror. Reign of Terror owned by the Burroughs family and being driven this evening by Miss Katrina Stevens. And with the number three saddle pad, A Touch of Red, owned by Mr. Ryan Manders, being driven this afternoon by Mr. Nasaje Lendi. This is for the 104 and 3 to 106 division time bar. Yeah, our stock car has now collected all three of our entries cleanly. A beautiful start right there. Three ponies up and three ponies out out of the first turn. It is some go somewhere. The rail pony being chased down by Reina Tara who settles in behind. A touch of red pushing the whole field along across us here on Spectator's turn. Into Paddock turn and down the back stretch they go. Some go somewhere the pace setter. Reign of Terror still pushing the issue, a touch of red, taking a peep on the outside of the field as they head around the Hang High turn. Out of the Simsfield turn, still running one, two, and three. It's some goal somewhere with Reign of Terror hot on his heels. A touch of red still chasing from behind. Around Pennock turn and down the back stretch for the final time in this heat. Some goal somewhere giving itself some breathing room now out in front by a half a length and growing. Over Reign of Terror with a touch of red still trailing the field off by a quarter. Out of the fourth turn and out of the home stretch they come. They will finish as they started. It is some goal somewhere. Reign of Terror and a touch of red. These are our entries for heat number three of the afternoon. With the number one saddle pad, Shady Maple, owned by the Boris family, being driven this evening by Miss Katrina Stevens. With the number two saddle pad, I Seize Overextended, owned and driven this evening by Miss Carissa Rabane. With the number three saddle pad, It's All About Me, owned by the Graceland Stables, being driven this evening by Mr. Dazar James. And with the number four saddle pad, Golden Glory, owned by the Martins family, being driven this evening by Miss Candace Martin. This is for the 103 and 2 to 104 and 2 division time bar. Our car has now collected our four entries for heat number three of the evening. Four ponies up and four ponies out. Let's sort them out as they come out of the first turn. And it is the rail pony, Shady Maple, with Katrina Stevens in the bike, setting the pace now up over IC's overextended. This is all about me in the number three hole. Golden Glory off the mark a bit, but chasing the field. Into paddock turn and down the back stretch they go. Shady Maple, the pace setter under pressure from IT's overextended. It's all about me right there in the mix as they all go around the hang of my turn. Out of the Simpsonville turn they come. It's still Shady Maple holding off IC's overextended with It's All About Me, Golden Glory now pushing the whole field across us here on Spectator's turn. Into Pack turn and down the back stretch for the final time. It's Shady Maple still out in front, but there goes. I see he's overextended, making way on the outside. It's all about me moving up to fill the gap. Golden Glory still chasing from behind. 
Out of the fourth turn they come. IT Silver extended, coming on very strong. Now challenging Shady Maple down to the wire. As IC Silver extended with Shady Maple. It's all about me and gold and glory.